Hello dear students, today we are going to learn multiplication. So let us first learn the rules for multiplication. Look at the first rule. This is the first rule, okay. Number can be multiplied in any order. The product will remain the same. Whether you multiply 1 into 2, the answer is 2. Or if you multiply 2 into 1, the answer will remain same. That means you can <clears throat> either 1 plus 2 or oh sorry 1 into 2 or 2 into 1. The answer will remain same. That means you can multiply in any order. Next rule. When a number is multiplied by 1, the product is the same number itself. Whatever the number be. For example, 500 ones the 500 1257 into 1 is equal to 1257 it means whenever we multiply a number with 1 the answer is the number itself understand third one is when a number is multiplied by 0 the product is 0 understood However, the small or however the num big number it is, whenever we multiply with 0, it becomes 0. For example, it's a very big number. Whenever we multiply this with 0, it becomes 0. Okay. Now we are going to learn how to multiply a big number. So, first of all, we will see how to multiply a big number with a digit. Let us take this big number 4527 into 8. This is very easy. Just you have to remember the multiply multiplication table. Okay. So here 7 is a 56. Right? 6 and you carry 5 here. Okay. Now 8 to the 2 is a 16. 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. 1 and 2 carries above. Okay. 5 8s are 40. 40 plus 2, 42. We'll write 2 and 4 will. 4 is going to carry. Again, 8 4s are 32. 33, 34, 35, 36. This is the answer. So, multiplication, multiplication of a big number with a digit is very easy as you have to simply multi, um, multiply each digit in a number with 8 from the left to right. Do you understand? Now, we are going to learn how to multiply a big number with a 2 digit number. So, let's see we have a big digit, big number. 3247 and we are going to multiply it with 36 at two digit number okay so let's write it first of all we have to put in a column so whenever you get a big number that should be multiplied with a two digit number then you may be thinking which number should multiply first so what we will do First, we start from the digit in the left, right. Okay. So, if you are confused enough, so you can do it separately also. First, multiply this big digit with 6. Okay. Now, 7, 6 is 42. So, it... Oh. 42, it's carry 4. Again, 4, 6 is 24. 25, 26, 27, 28. Again, it's carry 2. 2, 6 is 12. 13, 14. Carry 1. 3, 6 is 18. Plus 1, 19. So, here's the first. Um, here's the uh, product of first number. So, we are going to write it here. 8, 4, 9, 1. Alright. Now we have to multiply with the second digit which is 3. Again we will multiply this number. 2, 3, 4, 7 into 3. Okay. Always remember as this digit is in 
this tree is in tens place ones tens right so we have to leave the ones place empty okay then we have to start the answer from tens place do you understand so whenever we multiply a digit we, uh, digit that is in ones place so we have to start the answer from ones place whenever we multiply a digit in tens place we have to start the answer from tens place so we will leave this ones place empty we will put zero all right so now again start multiplication 3 7 is a 21 let's carry 2 4 3 is a 12 13 14 let's carry 1 3 2 is a 6 plus 1 7 3 3 is a 9 all right so the answer is 1 4 7 9 now what you have to do we have to add this two right 2 plus 0 is equal to 2 8 plus 1 is equal to 9 4 plus 4 is equal to 8 9 plus 7 is equal to 16 and it carry 1 10 plus 11 so this is the answer all right now we are going to learn multiplication of a three digit number by a three digit number okay same way so let's uh, so here in one's place we have 8 so first of all we will multiply this number with 8 so 8 to the 16 carry 1 8 5 is a 40 plus 1 41 7 is a 56 56 57 58 59 60 so answer is 6 1 0 6 now we have to multiply with 0 which is in 10 place that means you have to leave this place empty so first of all we will put it put here 0 then again multiply this number with 0 the next is it two zeros are zero five zeros are zero six zeros are zero here all places will remain zero right now let's multiply with three three is in hundred place so answer we have to start the answer we have to write the answer from the hundred place so that means ones and tens place will be empty so this is ones tens and then We have to multiply this number with 3. 3 3 is a 9. 3 5 is a 15. It's carry 1. 3 7 is a 21. 22. So answer is. So as it is in 100 place. We will start our answer from 100 place. 9 5 2 2. Now add this. 6 1 9 11 3 2 so this is the answer do you understand this if you understand this please solve exercise um, 2.3 question number one solve it and show it to me okay now let us learn how to divide a big number before that let us learn multiplying a number by multiple of 10 multiple of 10 means 10 100 1000 10000 okay it's very easy for example whenever you need to multiply 23 by 100 first of all what you do you separate the one and zeros first you multiply 23 with one which is 23 ones are 23 ones are 23 and here you have two zeros and put this zero is here okay so easy so i would show you here in question number c look 118 by 2 first multiply 118 with 2 8 2 is a 16 carry 1 2 1 is a 2 plus 1 3 2 2 1 is a 2 okay so it is 236 right 236 here two zeros are there at this two zero very easy now you see him here First multiply this 
4321 by 3. 3 1 is a 3, 3 2 is a 6, 3 3 is a 9, 3 4 is a 12. Okay, then 2 0. That is 2 0. Same here. 6401 into 1. 6401. Isn't it? So here two zeros are there. So add is two zero. So I hope you can do this one. So this is your homework, right? Okay. Now let us learn how to divide. Okay. Division. When a number is divided by one, the question is the number itself. So now thirty six divided by one is equal to thirty six. 999 divided by 1 is equal to 999. Now let us learn how to divide. When a number is divided by 1, the quotient is the number itself. So look this 36 divided by 1. The question is also what? 20, uh, sorry, 36. Next, 999 divided by 1. The answer is 999. Understand? So, whenever we divide any number by 1, the answer is the number itself. When 0 is divided by a number, the question is 0. So, look 0. When we divide it by 36 or 99, the answer we will get 0. Very simple. Now, when a number is divided by itself, the question is is 1. 36 divided by 36 is equal to 1. 999 divided by 999 is equal to 1. Now let us solve question number B from your exercise 2.3. So first question is 12,686 divided by 9. Always remember the dividend should be inside a box and divisor will be outside a box. So this is dividend which we are going to divide by 9 parts or 9. So this is divisor. This is dividend and this is called divisor, right? So let's find the answer. If you find difficult to find the answer you can write the multiplication table of 9 also here so 9 ones are 9 9 2s are 18 so 18. like that for your help you can write the multiplication of multiplication table of 9 also as you have to divide it by 9 you need this table so look first in first digit he is here 1 so you cannot divide 1 so look togetherly 12 you can divide 12 Because we have a number in we have a number in multiplication table that is 9 which is smaller than 12. So we can write here 9 ones are 9. Because when to multiply we need a smaller number or exact number. Okay, so we don't have 12 here. We have bigger than 12 and one smaller than 12. So we will use this smaller digit. Okay, so 9 ones are 9. So here remains 10, 11, 12, 3. So we now this digit will come down and it makes 36. So we know that 3, 4, 9 fours are 36. So we will give 4 times. 9 fours are 36. And then we have 0 and this 8 will come down. Okay. Now we need we cannot divide this 8 by 9. So we need an another number. So to get another number, we will put one 0 here. So when we put 0, this 6 will come down. Okay. Now we have 9 nines are 81. And we know that 9 tens are 90, which is bigger than 86. So we will use 81. So 9 nines are 81. So here remains 5. 
so it is what remainder okay now we have to check the number also for checking we need a formula do you remember the formula checking okay for checking we we know that dividend dividend is equal to divisor into so this is a formula dividend is equal to divisor into quotient plus remainder so here the divider the dividend is 12686 12686 which is equal to divisor this 9 is divisor question is 1409 and plus remainder this is remainder okay the remainder is 5 let us find it out first we have to multiply with 1,409 into 9. 9 9 is a 81. 9 0 is a 0. Is a plus 8. 0 plus 8 is equal to 8. 9 4 is a 36. Carry 3. 9 1 is a 9. 10, 11, 12. Okay. So this is the answer. 12, 6, 8, 1 plus 5. Again, plus 5. 6, 8, 6, 2. So, we got the answer. So, now look. If this and this are equal, that means your answer is correct. Understand? So, this is how to solve this. To write this multiplication table is not compulsory if necessary. If you feel like you need this, then you can write for your help. Alright? So, this is how to solve the question. If you cannot do this, please let me know. Otherwise, I will give the solve answer. Okay. But not today because I want you to try this exercise. Okay? And it is a great fun to do this multiplication and division. Right? Train your brain. Okay. Let your brain do some hard work. And please do this multiplication and divide. Alright. In case you do. In case you cannot do this. Please let me know. I will help you to solve this. Alright. Now you know how to multiply and how to divide. So be very careful. And please try to do it. Alright. Thank you.